My name is Marshall Tyler. I was born in Philadelphia, raised in Hawaii and San Diego. In college at, at Howard University, I used to get really upset um, that, you know, whenever I'd walk by, people would lock their doors or, you know, things like that, or I couldn't get a cab. And um, I thought, what was going on? I'm a student here, and I don't understand why people's perception of me was the way that it was. So. Um, that was one of the reasons that I felt like I wanted to get in, in film to figure out like how can we alter that image of what they see. I was, when I got here, I was basically just trying to get on like any way that I could, you know, it was like, I was very persistent about that, you know. Um, uh, I knew that I, I needed to um, make some inroads once I got here. And uh, so I was pretty much determined to, to make that happen. So I started as a production assistant on the set of Ali, and that's what got me out here. So I just love to tell stories. I've always loved films, um, and I love the process of making films as well. So um, I pretty much surrounded myself in, uh, with different filmmakers and, and uh, made, it, made sure that I got on as many sets as possible uh, to acclimate myself in the industry and just understand the whole process of making films. So I'm doing the uh, film right now, a short film, The Night Shift. It tells the story of the day in life of a bathroom attendant in an LA nightclub. You know, as a documentary filmmaker, I'm transitioning into narratives right now. And uh, it was interesting trying to, you know, find the truth in this story, in, in this, because in, I'm so used to, you know, being a documentary filmmaker, you know, and now, you know, you're trying to find the truth in someone's performance, you know, and trying to find the truth in, in, uh, in, in the way the story is written. And uh, that's really important to me, you know, always just trying to connect to uh, the, the most truthful aspect of whatever it is that I'm doing in that moment in the story. I'm leaving, Ali. You should too. Oscar is so white happened, even though it was a pretty much a pretty uncomfortable uh, situation. I'm glad it happened because it forces people who tend to be liberal in their, their thought process to, to analyze whether they're really um, uh, helping push uh, diversity further. You know? Oftentimes, I'd be one of maybe two or three black people, period out of a crew that let's say is 180 people, you know, so, and you feel that. You feel that and you feel uncomfortable and you feel like, you know, where are the other people that are like me and why aren't we represented here? You know, inclusion is not a bad word. It's just something that we have to acknowledge and it's something that we have to, you know, constantly push ourselves to make, uh, to, to, to make sure the representation is there.